Do you know Shaquille O'Neal has seven different base rookie cards on top of others, while Bill Russell has just three printed cards of in, in his playing days total. I've been collecting cards for 32 years, and if you're anything like me, it's a passion. Only 59 PSA 10s and a thousand, give or take, PSA 9s. I'm Professor Sports Cards, and join me while we research and learn the market together. But I, there is a line drawn in the late 80s there where now there's multiple rookie cards and cards of every player, making each rookie card less limited, and as well as just overprint and now more modern cards is a whole nother ball game and really interesting because there's cards like these that are one of one. Help the channel grow and give a like and subscribe. Funds are very limited. However, there's so many parallels and so many serial number cards. Does that water it down in the future? Or will there be select cards uh, of rookies? Patrick Mahomes, Joe Burrow, anybody, even John Morant, who's whose pop counts are ridiculously high this early in his career. There still should be certain cards that do hold value because there's very few of them. And as time goes on, the people with big money rather collect the more rare stuff uh, or you want the best you can get. And if you have more money, you can get the best. And what up, everybody? This is Robert Ory, a.k.a. Big Shot Bob, and you're watching Professional Sports Cards. Hey, by the way, go buy my rookie card.